morning students in previous grade we have started our new lesson that is videos and season lesson number 4 in which we have saw videos sun wind rain and cloud and also we have studied the forecast system now today we are going to start our new point that is seasons do you know that what is mean by season when a particular type of weather remains the same for a month or two it is called as season if the weather are remain for one or two month that uh, that is called as seasons okay actually there are main three type of season summer winter and rainy season okay but in your syllabus there are five types summer winter rainy season autumn month and spring seasons okay we will see that seasons one by one so let's start number one is a summer season summer season is a hottest time of the year summer season is a hottest time of the year it begins in april and end in june and the summer season is begins in a april and end in june month and the day are long in summer season but the night are short in summer seasons okay people like to stay indoor uh, in the afternoon and they use colors coolers and the people are also used in the summer season coolers fan and in air conditions because outdoor is a very hot a uh, very hot season or very hot uh, sun rays are fall on the earth that's that's why people like to stay indoors okay and we wear cotton cloth in a summer season because it keeps our body cool that's why we wear cotton cloth in a summer season so students here are a few things to take care in a summer season which things are uh, we which you will follow in the summer season let's see first one drink a lot of water because the environment is very hot that's why for maintaining the temperature of our body we drink a lots of water in the summer season and take a bath twice daily and in summer season we take a bath twice daily next one is a season is a monsoon and the monsoon season is begins at the end of june and the ends in september it begin in a june and end in a september and the rain bearing wind are called monsoon rain bearing wind are called as monsoon and the sometimes rainbow is seen in the sky in the monsoon season sometimes we see the rainbow in the sky and for protection from rain we are used in the rainy in the monsoon or in a rainy season umbrella raincoat we are used for protection from the rain okay now the next one season that is autumn autumn is during the month of october and november the weather is neither neither hot or nor be cold and the trees shed their leaves this is called the autumn season the leaves of tree are fall down that season is called as autumn season the next one is a winter season and this uh, the number of people are like the winter season why they are like it let's see the winter is the coldest time of the year the winter season, winter days are coldest time of the year november december and january are the winter months the november december and january are the winter months the 
days are short in the winter months and night are long in the winter months let's opposite to the summer season okay we wear woolen cloth from for protection from the winter season or uh, we get protection from woolen cloth from the winter season or from the cold days okay and we enjoy drinking hot milk and tea in the winter season we enjoy drinking hot milk and tea also these are about the seasons and last one is the spring season the spring season after winter in the month of february and march the weather remains very pleasant and it neither hot or not cold the plants get new leaves and flowers in the month of spring season plants get new leaves and flowers in the spring season and the nature looks a colorful and it is ideal season for the picnic when we are plan picnic we are uh, go outdoor in the spring season because the spring season is a natural look colorful and very pleasant season okay now two days are too heavy rainfall the two days and too heavy rainfall is is bad for crop or harmful for crop because it destroy our crop if the two or uh, less rain it is dry bread cows due to very less or no rain for a long time in a in an area now there are some useful things uh, we get from the sun let's discuss the sun it is most important source of energy do you know that already you know very well about that uh, the sun is a most important source of energy and we get energy from the sun in the form of heat and light we get energy from the sun in the form of heat and light and the energy that we get from the sun is called as solar energy and the energy we get we get from the sun that energy is called as solar energy the solar energy is useful for us in a many ways like for drying clothes and for making salt from a sea water and for drying of vegetables fruit and seeds and also for cooking food by using solar cookers these are the number of uses of the sun or solar energy i hope you all are got it about the weather and solar energy and also the seasons so let's remember it and thank you so much for watching